welcome to my channel. I'm Olivia B. And can you guess what we're doing today? We're packing for South Korea. <laughs> it's been such a dream to go there. I cannot wait to see the people, the culture, just practice the language and to experience something new in my life. It's going to be incredible because I get kind of a little nervous, a little shy when it comes to speaking the language, but I'm going to show you guys anyway, so <clears throat> bear with me. Okay. Anyaseyo, Nana and Olivia, Indira, Meneso, Pangawaya. I think that was pretty good. It's pretty good. Don't roast me in the comments. I literally, I literally am trying. I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> it's only going to get better from here period. So if anybody wants to like practice Korean with me, do a little language exchange. What's up? I'm free. Anyway, um, let's just get right into the video because today we're going to be packing all of my little outfits. I think my outfits are going to be very, very cool. Um, let me just show you. So here's my nightmare of a suitcase. You have my boots in here, some pants, some dresses, a little bit of everything. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get through this. So just let me show you everything. So this is actually a cute sweater. It's a turtleneck or a mock neck. It has cute little accent sleeves. And I love it. It's kind of cropped and it's gonna go with the camel skirt. <gasps> That's what we're going to call it. We're going to call it this, the camel skirt. So basically, I'm trying to find it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It'll go with something like this. Like the camel skirt. You know what I mean? So cute. Or shall I say, ravishing. <laughs> so this one is supposed to be my airport sweater. I really like it. It's blue and I'm supposed to be wearing this exact chain with it. It'd be cute. And then I'm just gonna wear that, um, the white skirt, the white pleated skirt. I thought that would be very, very cute to wear with this. Yeah, I think so too. Probably some thigh high boots because why not? But I'm nervous to do thigh high boots because of TSA. Like you have to take off your shoes and everything. And that's kind of annoying. So, so this is actually a two piece dress. And I love the material. I feel like it's so incredible. So it's also kind of like a bodycon dress. I think I would wear this with my tan boots. Um, this is gonna look gorgeous with this wig because this is a wig dolling. Um, bodycon kind of, it looks kind of short when you do it like that, but I'm not that tall. Um, like I am, Ugh, but I'm not. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I am, but I'm not. Like I'm 167 centimeters and I'm pretty average in America. It is from YesStyle, so I feel like I have to size up a little bit on YesStyle. Ooh, I don't like the tag showing like that. Anyway, this is the second part of it and it kind of covers the chest area and it kind of goes like off the shoulder. And it, I would hate for me to not actually be able to wear something once I get to Korea, but then at that point it's kind of like, oh well, I'm here, let's just have fun. And if someone can see my my butt, sorry. This dress, I love it. It's kind of ruched. And then I could see myself in like some fancy heels or something, but I'm probably gonna wear my thigh high boots that are like black. And I'm gonna have like kind of like a gothic vibe to this, but not really. It's like baddie gothic, like red and black is what I would go for. All right, so let's get started. I have these really cool pants. They're high rise type of thing, nor my pajama bottoms that I've magically am hiding because I didn't want you guys to see those. But yeah, we have these pants, really cute with sweaters like this. Um, we love it. Next item will be these, these little cream pants. I love the little pocket on the side. I think I got these from Shein or YesStyle. Absolutely one of the two. And these are so cute. They're like wide-legged. 
similar to the first pair except they have the little pocket on the side so it just makes them really cute and different and well, i guess not that different but just accented so this skirt is actually the first tennis skirt that i bought but i love this one because it had the buttons on it the buttons on the side so it doesn't have a zipper it just has these buttons but i think it was too small for me and i kind of made it my goal weight skirt but i feel like i should just give it away like if you guys subscribe to me um or just leave a comment and i get like at least 1k subscribers then maybe i'll do a giveaway and this will be in here yeah would anyone actually want this? So this is actually a skirt that I already had and I feel like I like it because it has the pink lacing at the bottom. Also got this from Chian. If, if something is not from Chian or from Yesdell, that's when I'll probably say something, but more than likely you can find all of these clothes on Yesdell or Chian because they're absolutely stunning. They, they fit really well. And I have an outfit idea because I have brown boots and like a cute little crew neck or something or this would be really cute with something. I really love pleated skirts. Very, very cute. This is a little bit hard to show. And the next thing is a dress. The next few things are probably gonna be dresses. And this one is like kind of like a white, um, what is it? Like a white collar dress, white t-shirt. No, white button up dress. That's what we're gonna call this because that's exactly what it is. And I just couldn't think of the word in my head at the time because I have not filmed in so long, but it's just buttoned up and it has ruching near the stomach, so it's very, very flattering, and then it flows out at the bottom, and it's not too short, especially if you size up. I got this on Shein, and I got a medium, and it's very, very fitting, and I am plan to wear this with probably my brown boots or something. Wow. I think I'm gonna look really cute, and I know some of these clothes, you guys are gonna be like, girl, stop trying to be a hoe, cause girl, what? These, these are not hoe clothes, I don't think, but I definitely think I am finding my femininity. And it's beautiful, it's freaking beautiful. And I love this dress. It's a brown dress and it kind of curves in at the waist and then flares out a little bit, but it is a bodycon and it has like the flare sleeve a little bit. Love this absolutely love it and i feel like it's gonna look so flattering and i have a little tan puffer coat that i could wear with this i don't even know if i didn't do the puffer coat i would wear a pea coat and it would look absolutely stunning okay i think this dress is really cute it's a little tight in the chest area and i was very skeptical of that but pretty much this is it like it, it even looks weird on camera i don't know it looks so weird <laughs> like this part looks really weird like, this is supposed to be where your boobs go. I have some big ones, so that's why it's kind of tight. It's pretty tight. It's pretty freaking tight, okay? And so, but it's cute. It's not tight around my body and the sleeves. I love this little witchy sleeve. Adorable. This is my Tulip Stories shirt or sweatshirt crew neck. This I got from YesStyle, 100%. The only thing about this is that like, I don't like the back. Like, look at this, look at the back. I, it looks very fake and I'm kind of annoyed at that. Like, ah, uh, it's okay. And the thing is, the big kicker on this one is that it came two months after I ordered. So I was so excited because on the side, it looks all cute and trendy and fashionable, whatever. And then I get it and it's like, come on, please. <laughs> the next sweater that I got would be this one. It's very cool. It has little colored sleeves. I actually bought this with the intention that I thought it would be cream, like it looks cream, but it's actually kind of like a pinkish cream color. And I was not anticipating that. So I kind of got bamboozled, but I like it anyway. The next sweater would be a crop turtleneck and it has strawberries on it. I love strawberries with everything in me, strawberry flavored anything. And that's a statement I could stand by. 
seriously strawberry anything someone get me a strawberry cake strawberry cupcake strawberry tartare strawberry something even my peanut butter and jelly strawberry strawberry i'm trying not to be cursing on here we're good these years we're good these days but it has kind of like an oversized sleeve very cropped gonna be wearing this with the cream pants and it's gonna give a little strawberry shortcake moment wow oh my gosh can you guys see my bonnet this whole time i'm embarrassed <laughs> wow um the next thing that i packed <laughs> is accessories so this belt it's giving like medieval goddess I love it. It snatches your waist so well. It has little buttons on the back. You can kind of adjust the front part. I think I threw mine on the bottom. And it kind of makes your waist look so small. Wow, it's really good. And the next thing I have are my mittens. They are so, so cute. They're kind of hard to get on actually. Like I didn't think they would be this tight and they make me feel like I have fat hands and that's not true. Like don't come for me. If you comment that I have fat hands, it's gonna be me and you. <laughs> but this, aren't they so cute? Like, come on. They're just really weird. Like you can literally see my thumb if I poke it out, but I guess that makes sense because I can still use them. <laughs> They're so cute. Pretty much just folding everything which I suck at because that's why my freaking suitcase looked crazy when I first showed you it. But it's great. And don't forget your essentials such as toothbrush, toothpaste, body wash, panties, or shall I say underwear, um, deodorant, a few sticks if you're sweaty like that, if you're greasy like that, feeling a little sweaty right now actually, that was a lot of work, but yeah, like totally don't forget anything. And as well as, did I say feminine products? I think I said feminine products and anything that it comes along with that. Um, that was lame. But anyway, see ya in episode two.